So, it's been about two weeks since I recorded that first episode. Um, it actually takes me quite a while to have the motivation to record. And as you can see, I've gotten quite a bit of work done. Uh, I'm wearing a lot of shiny blue rock now, which is all pretty heavily enchanted. I've got one of these little guys in my hand. So yeah, um, turns out I'm very productive when I'm not you know, recording. Also, this is a nightmare. Um, yeah, I need to get a better sorting system established, which I will do as soon as I build the uh, ex the big part of the house. Um, I I have not gone around to finishing this. Built another portal. Um, it's not got the same stuff going on as the last one. I intend to do that later, but uh just gonna leave that for now. Still no furnishings in my house, uh, which is a shame. But coming down into the basement, I have done a bit of work uh, making it look nice. This guy's still in here giving potatoes to his friends. I uh, found some mushrooms, uh, which I brought back here. And I've got myself a trading hall set up. Uh, an armor, which gives me my stuff. A weaponsmith. We've got a toolsmith. Some librarians. This guy's main thing is silk touch and sweeping edge. Uh, this guy has mending, which is always useful. Uh, looting three. Uh, this guy's got protection four, which is great. And this guy's got fire aspect, which, uh, yeah, my sword's looking pretty good now. Just need to upgrade sharpness to 5 and get knockback on there. And unbreaking. Also got a cartographer, a cleric, and a fletcher. Yeah. I'm planning on adding other stuff down here, like maybe a sugar far sugarcane farm or bamboo auto farm. Maybe a super smelter full-size storage system. Let's see, down here, I just took care of recently. Yeah, um, so there's not much iron in there. And there's only one villager so, uh, left in here. Uh, need those guys to keep working on breeding, but... Yeah, there were a lot in there. They have all been moved out to here. So yeah, this is pretty going pretty well so far. Ah, right. Yeah, I've got a raid farm set up. This is the same design of raid farm I did on the last server. I don't think I made any actual videos with it, though. It's a design by Logical Geek Boy. I'll leave the link to the tutorial in the description that I used. And here they all come. So yeah, uh, I'm going to keep working on this, and I'll be back with you in a minute. Okay, I'm back. I've done a bit of work on the roof. Uh, by which I mean I added this big window. Uh, I did some detailing over on this side. And uh, added another window on the back here. Um, and uh, yeah, here is the layout for the rest of the house. Uh, once again, I feel I need to reiterate, this is not my design. It's I'm following a tutorial by Mythical Sausage. I will leave the link to the tutorial I'm using in the description. This side will doesn't get anything because it's got a bridge roof thing connecting it. Yeah. I'm following this tutorial in the worst possible way, I think. But I've done some decorating on the interior. Uh, got a kitchen thing going on here, a little side table here. Uh, furnaces. I've got a little breeding corner up in here. I need to get some carpet, but I don't have sheep. But yeah, bookshelves and stuff. And then up here, uh, not much is going on. I've got the bed up here, out of the range of monsters. Got my dog. Something else I want to get on to is, uh, look at this. Look at this. I have way too many of these things. So, I'm planning on setting up a shop 
in the shopping districts. Yeah, in here there are kiosks which people will sell stuff at, and I want to acquire one of these kiosks, specifically that one there that's unoccupied. Yeah, they've, there's some pretty good stuff in here. This one sells metals, sells gold, which is sold out, iron, which is sold out, and copper, which is sold out. This guy here sells, um, well, it would be nice to know, uh, apparently he doesn't sell. This guy here sells, uh, lava. Alright, pretty decent. Uh, this guy sells potions. Strength here. Uh, nether wart. If he's out of stock. And magma cream. Uh, not much stock. At least there's some. Um, currently out of stock. Whatever this thing is. Uh, it's definitely. I don't know what this guy sells. Uh, this guy sells quartz. He's out of stock. This guy sells... This This is a casino. It's a gambling area. <laughs> Fantastic. And it's not even finished by the looks of it. Uh, another wood stuff. Uh, yeah, they've... Full stock. The wood itself isn't here. Uh, turtle shell helmets and turtle legs. Okay, they're perfectly in stock. This guy sells lava... Farm kits, okay. Uh, coal blocks, name tags, poppies, and bone blocks. All right, not for sale, just for display. You can't have them. <laughs> this guy's great. This is the plot that this is the kiosk slot that I want for my uh, totem shop. This guy sells slime and honey. He's very low on stock. This guy sells map art. Like that. <laughs> wow. Okay. Uh, basically, for map art, you need to pay him a netherite. <laughs> Holy crap. Chainmail equipment. Ooh. Iron block per set. I will... You know what? One iron block per set... Deal. Yeah. Uh, I will leave a link to the resource pack used for the armor, too. Alright. Uh, this is another plot, it looks like. Also, I saw your comment, brother. <laughs> I've got potatoes. I've got a food supply, alright? I've Look, I've got a food supply. I just... I know what I'm doing. The potatoes aren't meant for me. <laughs> Alright, they're meant for the villagers. But I if I need to, I've got them. Also, mushrooms. I can make I can get soup. I can have soup whenever I want now. So there. Ha! My brother's on the server with me. Well not on the server at the moment. Yeah, I've got a pretty good idea of things. I am going to eat my cookie and ask about a kiosk. So I'll be back. 